What's going on guys? Welcome back to Arcway, home of menswear and styling. My name is Tulu and today's video I'm going to show you guys how to style blue denim jeans. So I'm going to provide you guys with three different looks that you guys can take away. At the same time, you guys can elevate within your own style. And this is something that you guys will find inspirational. If you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know in the comment section down below. Give this video a big subscribe and also blow this channel up by giving it a thumbs up so the algorithm can hit it and we're going to the moon. As it gets brighter and gets hotter in the spring and summer, you're gonna need a pair of glasses. So I do have two different frames right here that I'm showcasing. One is kind of a little more funkier and one's a little more subtle. So this one right here, I got from ASOS. Uh, I picked up a bag of like 10 unique glasses. And I honestly think this is something that's quite different than the rest, especially out here in North America. People are not wearing things like this unless you are like an entertainer or if you are like truly into style you'll wear something like this, something really unique, different. I do like these a lot. It takes confidence to wear these type of frames because not many people are wearing them. And this is more subtle. Um, There's a lot more conservative look right here. But these glasses are my go-to. These are actually by Bong Look here from Montreal. Well, I say here as in Canada, but it's from Montreal. Um, I love these frames actually. These are called the Commanders, the Tortoise frame, and these ones are actually like so fire. These, I wish they didn't discontinue this because I would have picked up like three pairs. All right, let's go. All right, so the first, first look is very simple. Uh, at the same time, you got the CDGs on the feet. What up? And we got the blue denim jeans. I mean, it's complemented by the cotton shirt. So uh, this whole look is just so cool. I think it's a little bit throwback of like the 60s, I'm reminiscing from there with the with the jeans cuffed up a bit. And as you guys can see with the glasses, I have the bong with glasses that I mentioned. Um, so yeah, it just adds a cool little detail, a little bit of a nerd vibe with that look. But details matter, man. Details matter in your whole, in your own fit. It's how people perceive you and how people actually like react towards you. So keep in mind those small little things that you do within your own style because it really does change the perspective of many people. But at the same time, it's not for the people; it's for your own self. So um, always keep always keep positive and always dress the way you want because that will be the most authentic version of yourself. All right, so for this look was a little more chilled out. Um, as you guys can see, I have the black socks on. I actually would substitute that for maybe like a bluish toned sock, maybe lighter, like ocean blue or something. But all in all, I do like the fit of it. Um, you can actually go sockless as well. But as you see the details, I have a pure white pair of shoes. Uh, these are actually from Zara. Um, but these are not the ones I wear on a basis, daily basis, but they're for the studio. But yet again, jeans and like a simple pair of shoes, either it has logos or not, looks clean. As you guys can see, I got the Seiko watch. Um, and that really complements the whole look, the more of a business casual vibe. And I got the bottom with glasses, just goes so well in unison with the whole look. Um, this is a great look to have on every day. All right, so for this next look, I do like this one a lot. White socks, white shoes, blue jeans, striped shirt, and I got the cardigan. I think the cardigan just adds a different element to this whole look. It's very, very, uh, to me, it's very, very minimalistic. It kind of represents the like Japanese uh, inspiration that I do have a lot, just being from Vancouver. Um, just, just the way of their fashion and their perspectives on life, it, it really shows within my own style sometimes. And this outfit is like a compliment um, towards that so you know for that toward that culture I actually embrace a lot of elements and it's very it's very evident in the way someone would dress um, as you can as you guys can see not a big a lot sorry not a lot of logos not a lot of flashy symbols and that's something that uh, the Japanese fashion has has really embraced at the same time there are like streetwear brands that are big with logos but on the simplicity side uh, this is something that I really do like a lot. It's a very simple look. With the glasses, it adds a different dynamic to it. And actually, I encourage you guys to actually experiment with glasses this year. 
because it changes the whole trajectory of your outfit. Um, do that for me guys. Let me know what you guys. So crew, if you guys enjoyed that video, let me know in the comment section down below. Let me know what you guys enjoyed about the video. Also, let me know your favorite fit out the whole collection and know what you guys thoughts are based on the essentials that I showed you guys. Let me know what you guys liked about it. Let me know what you didn't like about it. But at the same time, yet again, thanks for watching guys. Support the channel by giving it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below. Drop a comment guys and crew. I'll see you guys soon.